Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you for having patience with yourself, being gentle. You know, even though times are hard, you can always start another day off in the new beginning. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. Also, if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl is about to upload her next video. Also, if you feel comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback and the content of my video. Or you just have to tell me about your impact and gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video has just gave you good vibes, peace and understanding, especially if someone needs to hear it right now, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. Thank you once again for stopping by my channel and showing so much love and support. It's always appreciated. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today I'm listening to Inner Guide Meditation, Meet Your Personal Spirit, Awaken Positive Energy, Peaceful Healing Music, and I will post that link in the description box below. Um, you know, I'm still uh, helping my daughter out with her um, book donation. If you've been with me for a while, I've been putting my daughter's website down. Uh, she's she's um, publishing a book where she has like different talents that has collaborated, uh, poets, you know, uh, artists, painting artists, uh, and she draws as well, and it's very beautiful. And if you can, even a few dollars, if you can donate to her, it'll greatly be appreciated. Just let her know that I sent you towards her way when you do. Um, today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, Ocus, when you pray, when you get more than you prayed for, that is, oh my gosh, I'm trying not to cry because that is so beautiful. When um, you can constantly, um, let me turn this music down. I said I want y'all here, but I'm not trying to drown you out. Um, we can constantly pray for certain things that happen in our lives, you know, because you know you always want better days. Um, always want better days to come towards your way and you know if you're working hard and pushing that positivity keeping a positive mindset even though that is like a task within itself especially if you're an empath any type of empath I mean you could be having a positive day and it could just be energy devil already is busy so it was just like today I'm trying to uh, upload my videos all of a sudden I go get something to eat and come back and take a you know like a quick break in between my videos next thing you know my computer cut off yeah, I'm just like you know what I'm not gonna allow this to aggravate me just start all over again so you know you have to also and I try to tell my you know my love bugs all the time that universe is constantly testing us you you can sit up here and say I'm gonna have a good day no matter what I'm gonna have a good day no matter what next thing you know something get thrown up in my <laughs> thrown up in your your process and it just just to piss you off but then you have to look at it's like you know it's life life does that you know we have our days where we have ups and downs but it's how you react to it how you respond to it you know we're not gonna always have a good day we're not you know every day is not gonna be a positive day or happy day where you're skipping through the tulips and seeing rainbows and you know all these little magical things but you have to be able to prepare for that because you know every day is not going to be a good day but it's just how you make it out to be and you know you can pray for so many things like I can pray for peace and positivity and it's just like when I when I put more of my videos out just you know when I get y'all's comments y'all don't know how many times I was up here and cry and I tell y'all that a lot because it's truly a blessing to me to know when I do my videos it's helping somebody having them look at things in a different perspective you know we're not always gonna have a good day but it's just how you respond to it is what's important you know people come up to you and they have like a negative impact on you okay you know I've had that every once in a while you know doing my videos I gotta tell anybody, when you're a YouTuber, you have to have to have that tough skin. I mean, it took me two years to start getting used to certain things. I push out so much positivity, but I'm blessed to have my negative 
my negative, uh, subscribe, you know, negative people dropping comments as well as my positive because my negative ones gives me that impact just to go ahead and say, you know what, I'm not going to allow their ignorance or, you know, their hatred stop me from what I'm doing because obviously if you don't have no haters, that means you ain't doing nothing right, you know, um, but it keeps on making you push. It makes you want better things and it's just like I can pray for, okay, give me peace and understanding and have a good day. Next thing you know, I can sit up here and push out videos and, you know, I could be tired or whatever. But knowing I can be able to help somebody, that's a blessing within itself to me. When I know that my videos can bring some kind of joy and happiness to somebody's life, make them think, you know what, hey, she's right. You know, I shouldn't be sitting up here spending my time moping around. You know, things happen. It really does. It's life. You know, we, we, we got to be able to expect the ups and downs. When life gives you lemons, make some daggone lemonade. Even if it's tart as I don't know what, add some sugar to it. You know, we don't have to, you know be moping around every day and it's just a blessing when I know I can visualize things that's coming towards my way I don't speak on them because I don't need nobody throwing no monkey wrench in it but being able to see the visions that I have knowing I have positive things that I'm working towards because before I used to throw doubt in a situation and that's what I mess you up when you throw doubt when you know you can pray for something and you're like Ugh. They'll give it to me if they give it to me. They, you know, they keep telling me whatever I push out is what I get back, whatever. But you can't have that kind of attitude. You know, just because things are not moving the way you want them to move don't mean they're not actually moving. You never know what's going on behind the scenes that you're not aware of because the universe wants to see how hard you're going to push towards that to make sure it really does happen. And that's how I had to do it. You know, when I, when I wake up every morning now, since, especially since my spiritual union, it makes me blessed to see another day. It gives me another day to say, you know what? I'm going to take the world by storm. Um, being able to pray for that peace of mind and gave me so much more to live for. Uh, having that positive vibe that I can be able to push out to other people, especially when they're having times of sorrow, times of sadness. When I can be able to just talk to somebody and give them that positive reinforcement. You know, see the things that others don't see in you, especially if there's somebody who has a negative impact. You know, towards your life because they're hating how they feel inside so they're trying to push their hatred towards you you know people struggle to like themselves every day so you know you can't be surprised if somebody hates themselves and they're not going to be pushing out negativity towards you hey you can't take that personal even though it's hard to do that because we're in human form we're going to take it personal because you like you're directing that towards me but when they're coming at you like that and they're not recognizing the light that you have inside yourselves when they can't recognize the light inside of them just keep on doing you is how you see yourself is what's important don't allow somebody to valid have to validate your happiness you should be able to validate that on your own and it, it's just like being able to see those things and believe in it you got to live it breathe it breathe be it you know exactly like Trent said you know Trent Selton used to say all the time or still says you know, um, just being able to look at other motivational speakers, you know, I'm like, gosh, you give me, you know, you give me that, that energy to make me want to do more. You know, when I get your uh, comments, that makes me want to do more. And that's a blessing to me within itself. You know, I keep saying that, but it's a beautiful blessing because before I used to cry all the time and ask God, why did you allow me to go through these things? Why, you know, why did I have to find out all these things about me and my family after my dad died you know all these things they have a reason for happening where they happen you know I'm not happy the fact that I've never got a physical reunion with my dad but knowing that the positive impact even though I went through a lot of devastation and mishaps I can at least say my pain has brought so much positive purpose towards my life you know I don't know the bigger picture that God has waiting for me I don't know the road that he's leading me on all I can do is just keep walking down it and pray for the best hope for the best and believe that better days are coming for me so it's just like when you're looking at your life pray for the things you want work towards the things that you want and when you pray for them and knowing that God and universe is seeing everything that you're pushing out is for towards positivity and trying your very best even though you you when you push it out you might get little in return you have to be grateful for every single thing that comes in your life you know just the fact is you got a roof over your head you, you got clothes on your back you got food on your table it might not be the food that you want to eat but there are some people out there that, that's struggling to find out what they're going to eat that day because they don't have any money to do that so you know you 
don't rob yourself of happiness when you can see somebody else is struggling just to find that. You know, um, being able to work towards your life, knowing that blessings are coming towards your way, you have to believe it. You gotta work hard to be able to get it. Sometimes it takes a lot for you to be able to get that, but like I said, you, if you keep pushing out the positivity affirmations towards yourself and knowing things are coming towards your way, hey, it's coming. But you, you gotta work towards those things. You have to be able to believe and have faith in, especially in things you don't see. That's what takes real strength because a lot of us as humans, we have to be able to see it to be able to believe it. You know, it's even a saying, ha, I gotta see it to believe it. No, you don't. You don't always have to. You have to feel that vibe knowing that better things are coming. You have to be able to believe it. And so when you pray for things and you know that God's sitting up here saying, you know what? He or she's doing working their butts off to get what they want to get. I'm going to go ahead and not just bless them for the things that they asked for, but bless them with extra because they weren't expecting that. So when you know that you got that coming, be grateful for that. Be grateful for it. I'm trying not to cry because that's a beautiful thing. Because it's just like, y'all know I'm a little, you know, I ain't no power ranger all the time. But, you know, when I see blessings coming my way, you know, and my blessing is to be able to bless somebody else, then that's a blessing within itself as well. So keep praying for the things you're praying for and work hard towards the goals you're trying to meet. Because when you do that and God and universe sees that you're doing that, don't be surprised when you're getting blessed with things you never asked for. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content of my video. Much love to everybody. Pushing love out to Jesse. Much love to you, Avery, Val, Robert, Roger, Miss Mickey, everybody. Much love to you. Many blessings. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. I love a chance to hear from you. And, you know, share the video. Give me a thumbs up. And, you know, just pray. Just pray. Better days are coming for you. Just wait and see. And I'll see you on my next video. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And trust and believe there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. I know I pray for y'all every day. And I'll see you on my next video. Peace. And be wild.